guys, welcome back to my channel. So my house is on fire. I'm back in better, so no excuses. I don't care if my house is burning down. I'm still gonna get the video done. Guys, that meme is so funny. Is that tu cállate la verga, pincho oscuro metiche? Oiga, tu cállate la verga, pinche oscuro metiche. <laughs> hey guys, so today in this video, I'm gonna be doing the copy and paste Latina makeup. I'm gonna be recreating it. I'm kind of scared because I usually never do my eyebrows. Like, I always just fill them in. But this time, I'm gonna do like a full glam. Can you guys believe I went out yesterday on a Monday? So, what I was planning on doing, well, I had to take pictures yesterday and we went out to eat and we went to the Aria. It's a casino in Vegas. And then tell me freaking why. We were just planning to get drinks. Nothing too crazy, you know, because it's a Monday. Well, the table right next to us, they send us some drinks because we were like getting drinks and they send us some drinks and I was like, Thank you so much. And then after they were like, oh, like, what are you guys doing later tonight? We're like, oh, like, nothing much. I wasn't thinking I was gonna go out or anything like that because it's a Monday and bitch, I'm underage. <laughs> but they were cool people. Like, they weren't really like, like too much, you know? We ended up going out, dude. And tell me freaking why. It was the best night of my life. <laughs> And I got home like at 5 a.m. We were so drunk and I'm just like, bro, I can't be doing this. But I mean, you know, I'm not slacking. I woke up kind of early too, like around 11 because I went to sleep like at 5, 6 and I woke up like at 11. So I guess it's not that bad. So I wasn't sleeping all day. When I drink, I usually don't like black out or I don't like over drink. Like I like to be able to control myself. I have my limit, you know, once I'm drunk, like I'm like, okay, I'm not drinking no more. And then I'm just chilling. But I'm like, never again. On a Monday, like that's crazy. The place that we went to it was packed. Like, I was like, what? Like, people be partying on a Monday. That's crazy. But anyway, so tomorrow I'm going to go to Hot Pilates tomorrow morning. What I'm going to do today, we're going to go to the mall because I got to go Christmas shopping. Dude, I should have done my eyebrows first. But no, I can still do them before I set my face. I must still do them. And I need to get my eyebrows on too because they're literally like super hairy right now. This concealer, damn, it woke me the fuck up. It brought me back to life. So guess who came back to my life again? Guess who came back? I mean, they always come back, right? This guy, right, that we don't talk about. Well, we're talking about him right now, but we don't usually talk about him. So it was this guy that I used to be on and off with. Every time, like, I try to distance myself, he always comes back. And then, like, usually I'm not the type to let people in again. Once you do me wrong, there's no going back. You're not going to be in my life anymore. But with him, it's just different. <laughs> with him, I can't stand on business. But I mean, like, I'm gonna stand on business. Like, this time, yes, I will. I didn't stand on business, and then he ended up doing me, like, ten times worse. He comes back the moment where I don't care anymore, and I'm just like, oh, I don't give a fuck about you. And then he tries to either buy me, or he tries to, like, like no, like, did it, what do you want me to do? Da -da -da -da, like, I'll change, like, all that bullshit, you know? And then I'm like, oh my god, viene estupida que le creo. And I'm like, okay, te amo. But more of the story is he did me 10 times worse. But I mean, it's fine. We live and learn, you know? I feel like with him, it was just a cycle I kept on repeating. And now it's gonna like be cut off. It's about to be the new year. I need to start all fresh. New year, new me, new phone, who did, new bitch, new car, new everything. I need to get my shit together, you know? New body, everything, new chichis, new you know say this because if i treat myself better than you treat me then what the fuck do i need you for like i don't want you to be a part of my life if you're not gonna treat me the same way i treat myself or better than i treat myself you know i'm not gonna like lower my standards for you like especially because boy you don't what the fuck do you even bring to the table he brings money but um we're not gonna talk about that because he's still treating me like shit. Like he doesn't even provide for me all the time. Like just because he tried to get me back. Cause I was like already like, no, like it's too late. Like I don't trust you. Like I don't believe you. He's like, no, no, no. And then he buys me with money. And it's the first time he's done that. So I was like, you know what? I'm gonna give you another chance. <laughs> and then yeah, that's how it went. But then he did me 10 times worse. Cause I really thought. I really thought, but more of the story is, so after when I came back to Vegas, we ended up not in bad terms. Well, we did, cause I unfollowed him. I unfollowed him and I was like, yeah, fuck that. I'm not gonna go to the same cycle all over again. He had his chance, he went and blew it. That's his loss, not mine. I'm only going up and I'm gonna get a glow up from this. Cause every time I get heartbroken, I always get a glow up and I always do 10 times better than them. Like Bad Bunny said, Si a ti te va bien, a mi me va mejor. 
Me la paso bebiendo hasta que salga el sol. Yo te deseo el bien, te deseo lo mejor y lo mejor ya te pasó. Bitch. <ríe> y si tú pensabas que por ti estaba sufriendo, ¿será que no me han visto? En la calle rompiendo. Okay, let me stop. I'm about to do a whole ass concert right now. I followed him. I was like, yeah, I can't be letting this happen again and again and again. Like, valorate, chica. Valorate, nena. Valorate, bebe. And then my mom was like, why'd you follow him? Like, oh, you're taking it too personal. Like, he's gonna know. I'm like, that's good that he knows that he fucked up. I don't want to see him again. Like, why am I gonna see him? He lives all the way in Mexico. I live here. Like, it's never gonna work out. Me, sadly. Where I was going with this, oh, yeah, bravo followed him before guys but i've all followed him before like before when we used to be on and off i started talking to someone so i unfollowed him because i was like nah he had his chance he went and blew it da, 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 da. and then guess what he did so like one of his friends like girlfriends like the girl started texting me out of nowhere she was like hey girl how are you how you been and i'm like oh that's odd because she would never fucking text me i'm pretty sure she don't care about me i was like oh i'm doing good what about you she's like we miss you i'm like who's we but Loki, I was like, who's we? I was kind of interested. So I kind of went back to the same cycle again. He thinks you don't want to talk to him anymore. Like, do I give him your number? And I'm like, yes, give me my number. <laughs> Please, I need him to break my heart again. <laughs> my life's been too boring lately. Don't do entertain me for a little bit. And then leave and then break my heart like he always does. A moment of silence please because r.i.p r.i.p i'm not talking to him ever again well i'm never gonna say never because you never know you know but no i'm not planning on seeing him anytime soon like i really like i'm really focused right now and what i want to do is like my music i really want to do that so i'm not gonna let nothing get in the way and nothing distract me so i'm good off of that for right now i guess right now <laughs> well okay so where was i at oh the, yeah so she was texting me she was like hey girl how you been we miss you so then that's how it started again the same cycle started again i ended up following him again like we like started talking again but it's because i tried to get rid of him and he does not want to let me go you know and it's like i could easily be like boy get the fuck out but me i'd be letting him back in and that's the problem <laughs> i let him back in this time because well i did believe him a little bit <laughs> but i also believed him because he wasn't only talking this time he actually did something you know like with this actions and then also because he gave me money no well, the my point in this whole conversation which why i brought him up it's because dude so i hadn't followed him right this time like for real, i was like no like we're done i didn't text him like we're done or anything but i was just like really mad i'm not gonna say what he did because I'm just so over the story. I've been saying it to everyone and it's so annoying. Like, it's not even worth it. I'm not even gonna waste my saliva because I'm not interested anymore. Yeah, when I had came back from Mexico, I followed him and I was like, yeah, I'm never gonna see him again because he's not treating me like how I want to be treated or how he should be treating me. So instead of begging him or being there for him or waiting until he acts right, I'm gonna treat myself good and I'm gonna give myself the world because I deserve it. I have a good heart, so I'm not gonna let him take advantage of it. So that's why I just skedaddle and I follow him. And yeah, that was it. And then I didn't hear it from him. Like he didn't text me or anything, which I was like super mad because I was like, bro, like I thought you cared about me. Boy. <laughs> but okay, whatever. And then tell me fucking why I wake up today and he texts me. And I was like, bro, you're dumb. You shouldn't have texted me because I'm not gonna text you back, obviously. Like, what did you think this was? And you know how he texted me, guys? Like, he obviously knows that I stopped following him because, like, no shit does. He, like, noticed for sure. Like, you know what he texted me? He was like, Hola, mi amor. You're kidding me, right? He thought I'm gonna be like, Hola, mi bebe, hermoso. He thought I was gonna be like this, like how I usually be. But no, bitch. Not this time. Not next time. A lo mejor en otra vida, bebé. Pero en esta, no. En esta, ya no voy a ser tu pendeja. I'm sorry to tell you, but I'm not gonna be your bitch. I'm not gonna be it. I'm sorry. Like, I just decided it already. And I feel like since it happened like two, three weeks ago, I feel like I don't give a fuck anymore. You know? Like, at first I did. But not anymore. And I'm not gonna text him. Like, I probably still care a little bit you know but i don't care as much as i did like a week ago you know but see me text you eso hoy wey no mames 
piensa que sí le voy a contestar. Como, I'm not even gonna answer him. I might answer him when I'm in Mexico. I'll be like, hola, pero lo voy a usar a la verga. When you actually care for them, like, they treat you like shit. Like, you gotta treat them bitches like shit for them to love you. You gotta be, like, super mala for them to actually like you. I don't know, guys. <sighs> I'm just traumatized, okay? <laughs> Just a little traumatized or whatever. Pero ese no es el punto. El punto es que pues ya va a salir mi canción para el otro mes. Qué emoción. Y ya van a ser los holidays. Y ya todo va a estar bien. Porque ya casi lo estoy superando. Entonces está súper bien. Lo que me sorprendió es que me textió así como que nomás dijo, hola mi amor. Si me hubiera dicho como que, ¿por qué me dejaste de seguir o algo así? It would have made more sense, you know? But Hola, mi amor, like, he really does not care about me. <laughs> he just wants to keep me attached. Like, that's what I noticed. But too late, boo. It's not gonna work out for you anymore. Guys, I forgot to do my eyebrows. Mira, por andar chismeando, se me olvidó hacerme las cejas. Y les iba a poner concealer y todo. Because I already set my eye. Hopefully, I could still blend it in. Yo, la verdad, estoy muy agradecida con los que miran mis videos. Los amo. Los amo. Gracias, gracias. Porque, la verdad, yo a veces pienso que, oh, no me mira tanta gente. A veces, la verdad, pienso que no me mira tanta gente. Y luego, cada vez que voy a un lugar, me reconocen. Me dicen, oh, my God, are you Alexia? Y no me... Dude, I'd be thinking no one watched me. And then like 20k people be watching me or like 15k people. That's actually a lot of people. Like that's literally an arena. That's an arena like to see one day. Uh, one day. Primeramente Dios y pues sí se me hace realidad. I'm so grateful for you guys that all of you guys that watch me. I'm so grateful. Thank you so much. Cállate la verga tu pinche oscuro metiche. That shit's so funny. Guys, but I'm gonna be doing a video. I'm gonna be doing a glow up with me for 2024 because we're glowing up on him. We have to glow up on the people that have done us dirty before. We need that shit now before 2024. Estoy haciendo esto al revés. Hubiera empezado con mis cejas. Que estúpida. No te creas, Alexia. Te amo mucho. Tú no eres una estúpida. Tú nomás estás un poquito mensa, pero... Pues está bien, bebé, te amo. Ámense, chicas, ámense. No van a poder amar a nadie si no se aman a sí mismas. Y nadie las va a amar si no se aman ustedes mismas. Love yourself, love yourself, please, because no one else will. No, I'm just kidding, everyone will. Ya me cansé de llorar y no amanecer. Ya no sé si maldecirte o por ti rezar. Parrandera, paloma negra, paloma negra, ¿dónde, dónde andará? Tengo miedo de buscarte. Y de encontrarte Donde mis amigos Me aseguran que te vas But love. Qué bonitos ojos tienes Quiero chuparte el pene Con todo respeto Espero no te molestes Ya está cerca de diciembre Ojalá no te enfermes para que tú me lo entierres. Te amo, bebé. Te amo. Te amo, preciosa. Eres una belleza. Te amo. Ya terminamos. Ya terminamos. Gracias a Dios. Ahora me voy a poner este gelecito para que no se me paren las mendigas. Para que no se me pare el pelo. Now I need to put my lashes on. I'm gonna just put mascara. Well, like a little bit. So we're gonna try different pairs. We're gonna see which one gives more like copy and paste Latina Mika Buddy. Hashtag single. Hashtag looking for the hoes. We're gonna see which one looks more like that one. Oh my god, guys. I forgot to put bronzer. Okay, I think it was put a little bit of mascara. Not put a lot. So, let me stop. 
because I was about to start doing my lashes. What is a uh, what is a uh? no las puedo poner no las puedo poner porque me puse me puse mucha mascara Like gusano vibes. No, I'm just kidding. I lucky do like these ones. Wait, Vivelin, ¿te gustan? ¿Eh? Estas, ¿qué piensas de estas? Sí. Pero no, no siento que sean como de Mari. This is. <laughs> Guys, so I'm gonna try this other lash style. It's cute, but I feel like it's not giving Latina makeup body. You know what I mean? So we're gonna try these lashes that I got from Sheen. Dude, I bought them and I never used them. ¿Qué es eso? Pito, pati, si lo permite tu chin. Tengo mucha feria, cachin, chin, chin. Y ya terminé. Ahora me voy a hacer los labios y ya casi estamos, chicas. I need to get used to these lashes because I feel like it's just too much. Final step. Now I'm gonna do my hair and then I'll show you guys the final look. Hey guys, so I just finished getting ready. This is the final look. Ta -da! I'm actually really loving this. I just need to get used to the lashes because I'm like, whoa. But they actually don't look that bad. I feel like a baddie. I feel like a baddie low-key. I feel like a um, Latina baddie. <laughs> Latina baddie. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys like this video and stay tuned for my next YouTube video. Mwah.